money, money, yeah, yeah, money, money, yeah, yeah. What's up, Thriftinistas and Thriftinisos? It's your girl, Thrift in Huntsville, and I am back today to tell you how I made $300 in three days. So if you follow me on Facebook, I made a post last week and I said, what would you do if you had an extra $300? And when I tell you I got an overwhelming response, oh my gosh, people had so many ideas. They would travel, they would buy insurance, they would pay off debt. So, you know, like with me, I just one of those people who it just like got my mind, like the wheels turning. And I was like, well, what can I do to make $300 quickly and legally? So that's what I was thinking like, what can I do? So if you don't know, I am an entrepreneur. I do have a Poshmark closet and I do sell this shirt, the Thrift Anista shirt. But of course, when you're waiting for that money or for someone to purchase your items, you have to wait a few days before you actually get it. So I was thinking like, hmm, if I needed the money quickly, I don't wanna go to a bank and ask for a loan. I don't wanna go to my family members or do a title loan or the payday loans. You know how that goes. Like, I need this $300 and I'm not trying to give blood or plasma. So I was like, well, hmm, how about I sell stuff? So I was like, okay, you know what? Some of the things that had not sold in my Poshmark closet, I said, let me put those in a bag and go and see if I can sell them. Took them to Plato's closet and the first day, y'all, they gave me $120 for my items. So I was like, okay, I see you, girl. So I was like, you know what? Let me go ahead and try to go back or see what I can do. So my brother, he is actually in the Navy and he's getting ready to go to Japan. So he called and he was like, hey sis, I have some items. I wanna to contribute to your store. Do you sell men's items? I don't sell men's items, but I'm a hustler, baby. Okay, so I was like, yes, I will take it. So I went to Tennessee, obviously, to actually see him off and to pick up those items. When I got to Tennessee, he gave me the stuff and I looked and it was like some really good stuff. So I was like, hmm, let me hit up the Plato's Closet in Tennessee. So I went to the Plato's Closet in Tennessee and they end up giving me like $55 for the items that he gave me. So at this point, I'm like at $175, $180. So some of the items that they did not take, I was like, okay, no worries. I'll put them in my vehicle, you know, bring them back. So when I got back to Huntsville, um, today, what I ended up doing was I took the rest of the items and then, of course, I just started digging around the house to try to find some stuff. And I put it and went to Plato's Closet here in Huntsville. And then they actually took the other items that my um, that Tennessee didn't take. So they gave me additional like $130. So that put me right at the $300 mark. So, oh my gosh, like, can you believe it? Like I got $300 in three days and it was legally like, come on y'all, it was legally, I did not have to work an extra shift at work. I did not have to actually go out there and just put in like hours or begging family members or trying to get that, I don't owe anyone. So this is just a quick video for you to actually get an additional stream of income. I know a lot of people actually responded to it and so my whole thing is, when you have a problem, I try to offer a solution and the solution is, look around your house. Find stuff that you're not using. It's summertime, throw that crap in a yard sale, start going to consignment shops, get rid of this stuff, y'all. I'm telling you, you have money right underneath you and you don't know it. So that is my spill. I hope you like this video. If you would like to see more videos like this about additional streams of income, please comment below. Let me know what was your experience with Plato's Closet. If you want me to do videos on to show how they take my stuff in Plato's Closet, girl, comment below. I have no problem at all with going ahead and sharing the tea, okay? And also, I'm thinking about doing a reseller's course for just some people who want to get into reselling because, girl, it is easy. And I want you to make a coin like I make a coin. And you know what? I'm not stingy with it. If you would like to see a reseller course, you know what to do. Comment below. <laughs> so. Everything will be in the description box. Become a thriftinista. Okay. Check out my blog. Like, comment, subscribe. Talk to you later. Bye.